Hello everybody, this is Naman Jain and I am here to present my project on web crawl. Uh, but before that, let me tell you what a web crawler is. A web crawler is an internet bot which systematically browses the world wide web, typically for the purpose of web indexing. Web search engines use web crawling software to update their web content or indexes of other sites web content. Web crawlers can copy all the pages they visit for later processing by, an, by a search engine which indexes the downloaded pages so the users can search much more efficiently. Scope of the web crawler depends on the algorithm that is used in the web crawler. Now the better the algorithm, the faster the traversal. Now let's go and get on to the project. Well, uh, I'll go straight away to the design or the working. Now this is the layout. Uh, starting with the start URL. So start URL uh, specifies what, uh, which is the first page to be crawled by the crawler. That is specified by the user. And uh, next is maximum URLs to crawl. Well, uh, as the name suggests, uh, it is the maximum number of URLs that are crawled before the crawler stops. Then is the matches log file. Now. Uh, Whenever a string is searched on uh, any of the link, if the match is if the match is found on that particular page, the link is stored in the matches log file. So uh, that is how the matches log file works. Then the search string, obviously, uh, the thing that the user wants to search in uh, all the web pages. Then uh, th this was the search panel. And then the second panel is the. Uh, statistics panel uh, here crawling uh, is uh, referred to uh, the crawl uh, the page that is to be crawled or uh, that is being crawled uh, right now then the crawled URLs will uh, give you the number of URLs that have already been crawled the URLs to crawl will be the number of uh, URLs that it has uh, extracted from different web pages but uh, they are still in the uh, queue uh, waiting for uh, them to be parsed. Then uh, crawling progress, this is the progress bar uh, that shows uh, how much uh, of uh, how much of the crawling has been done and how much is left. Then search matches, the number of pages in which uh, the matches have been found. The third is the matches table. Here uh, in every row uh, you will be shown that uh, uh, which are the links that, that uh, have matched uh, that have matched the search string? Uh, that means uh, the search string has been found in these pages. Uh, the same as the matches log file. So uh, let's start with it. I will just write this. Uh, Twenty URLs. Search string is web. Then search. Now uh, you can see that uh, the search panel is now disabled. So the user cannot uh, change anything regarding the search. And uh, you can see crawling the link has been, uh, the link is there in front of crawling. Then crawled URLs show 11 URLs, 12 now. Uh, that means uh, the number of URLs that already have been crawled. And you can see that out of 17 uh, crawled URLs, yeah, you have got 16. That, that means uh, the matches are one less than the crawled URLs. URLs to crawl shows uh, the, no the total number of URLs that have been, uh, the links that have been extracted and have been added in the queue so that uh, they will be uh, parsed later. So there, there had been 632, but uh, as the user uh, as the user specified that only 20 uh, URLs are to be crawled, so uh, we are not searching for the rest. So 19 matches have been found, and um, uh, th this is the URL table. This is the table, and uh, you can see uh, 19 are matched, and out out of 20. So, uh, as I was talking about the matches log file, let's go and have a look at the matches log file.
yeah this is the matches log file as you can very well see all the matches have been listed in this txt file that's all folks thank you for listening